YouTube. I was supposed to go for a walk today. Uh, just decided to stay in. Even though it's overcast, but no threat of rain at all. Rain's not supposed to be forecast, period. Uh, basically, just, uh, uh, had a busy day yesterday. Kind of worn myself out uh, after hauling that big load of groceries and goodies. Uh, of course, most of it was all soda. That's what makes it heavy uh, to cart around, uh, basically. Uh, made, good thing I made my choice of pushing that car from Hy-Vee to downtown because otherwise it was difficult to just get it on and off the one bus. Just imagine two buses. That means you get on one bus, getting right to downtown, get a transfer, and ride it up to here. Uh, then you gotta get off the bus again. So, yeah, then <laughs> three flight of steps uh, just to get up here. And that, I know probably in the comments section, Chuck, you should have took the elevator. And remember what I said, what elevator? There is no elevator here. Not even an escalator. <laughs> Alright, it is what it is. I got my workout yesterday. It was a heavy load. It was an overload. <laughs> it was overweight, uh, basically. So, uh, yeah. So right now we're just going to sit here and relax. Uh, Andrew will be home in a little bit. Oh, by the way, time you watch this video, you guys be in the middle of Labor Day weekend. The unofficial end of summer. We haven't had ours yet. Uh, of course, we haven't filmed it yet. So this is why we are seven days behind in our videos. Uh, of course, with the internet way it was this past summer, and it's still acting up again today. Uh, we're a good thing we are seven days behind in our videos. I guess that was a good choice. Uh, after we took our hiatus uh, last December, remember we took a break from YouTube uh, for the most of the month of December, uh, till the, almost to the end of the year, then prior to, to calculate to get back to seven days, we had to start filming on the last two days of December to get it into when we started up in, uh, what was it, January 6th of this year, we started back up and that, so, uh. And we did a few live shows, and as like I said, it was a strange year so far, uh, based this year, if you notice on the channel. Uh, we started the year not monetized. We were both, we were around 816 subscribers uh, as of uh, back in January. Then I guess that fluke month in February, uh, correct me if I'm wrong in the comments, uh, basically... Our subscriber count just went through the roof, uh, basically. And it's still growing today. Uh, last, just this past week, uh, we've been averaging at least one new subscriber every day. Uh, which, that's basically would be our minimum goal that we had when we started this channel. So, as of we're filming this video, I think I had the official count of 1313. Uh... Sounds like a lucky number. Oh, I was watching a another YouTube video. Uh, I guess some guy went live early this morning. And uh, I'm not going to mention the channel's name, but he had a full hour, 50 minute video. And it's usually one of those uh, big time, uh, you, you know, probably some of you... Uh, people know who watches our channel probably know might be what I'm talking about maybe heard about it uh, I guess I was watching the replay I guess he was mumbling bumbling and all that stuff like I'm doing right now <laughs> but uh, but around the 24 to 25 minute mark all of a sudden he went silent uh, basically he just went silent uh, then all of a sudden just about a few more minutes later, all of a sudden, he started snoring. The guy fell asleep during his live stream. Classic quality content, finally, from that channel. Where you're just stumbling and bumbling, trying to figure out what to say, how to say and talk to your audience. And he goes to sleep. <laughs> I love, I think it's one of the classic videos I ever watch on YouTube, where basically a guy... During the live show, fell asleep. 
I know our channel makes people fall asleep, but I never figured the creator goes live fall asleep. Wow, that was a classic video. Um, I wish I could share it, but I won't. But you may have heard about it already by then. It's all old news. But yeah, it was it was a classic video. I enjoyed it. Uh, basically, did I watch the other four hours and twenty minutes uh, while he was snoring? Nope, I was done after the. Uh, I was done with him around the thirty-five minute mark <laughs> on him because he was snoring. Okay, I was just I was in the kitchen cooking up uh, some chicken tenders that Angie loves. I decided to have a few of myself for lunch. Angie will be here real quick, uh, shortly, in a little bit. Uh, just, uh, I know the computer's off, but I'm just, uh, currently was uploading, I was editing some videos, I was trying to catch up on my editing, and other stuff, and, uh, sometimes when the internet goes out once in a while, you get a little frustrated, so you go off for a little walk, sometimes you forget to bring the camera along. So I was just doing some editing, uh, actually I was uploading some videos, uh, Luckily, during the upload, when the internet goes out, luckily YouTube got it on their end. Oh, I, what what YouTube used to do back in the day, uh, when we first started this channel, anytime the internet went out, we had uh, YouTube couldn't get the whole video, so uh, we had to take the video down and re-upload it, uh, basically. So yeah, so it was uh, it was uh, that time. It was strange back then, those days, but. Today, I guess technology is catching up where basically when we send the video to YouTube and Google, they got the whole thing and it looks like the, uh, looks like the, uh, the upload is a show for them, uh, basically. But yeah, uh, I was lucky the last, I think the last, I think the last seven video, I think seven of the last, uh, 20 videos were I uploaded where the internet went out and somehow YouTube and Google still uploaded the entire video so it's always smart to double check uh, basically just in case if they did not get the entire thing then uh, or the or we used to get a message what they call incomplete uh, upload or something like that so that's when we used to take the video down and re-upload it and keep our fingers crossed the internet stays up the internet's been a been a problem for a long time up here not just this summer but we have basically since we started the internet back in uh, 2009 where we used to be on a phone line where basically it goes in and out in and out in and out too uh, basically so uh, it, it may be the wires I don't know but uh, we dealt with it so we're done with it we're tired of complaining about it the, if they don't want to fix it they don't want to fix it all they can tell us they test the they test our connection and all they tell us our connection is good. Our connection is good. I got tired of hearing it. I'm tired of having the maintenance guy come up here. Well the media com maintenance guy come up here and test it and test the system out and find out we're still good on days well, I guess I must have lied. Because right now when right now it looks like it's raining. <laughs> yeah. It's raining. See how wet the grill is? You can hear it. <laughs> Weather a lot. Weatherman lied. It was not supposed to rain, but it's raining. But yeah. Okay, I don't want to make this video too long. We gotta get Angie in this when she comes home. Uh, I'm gonna have some of the chicken tenders. We'll show it here real quick. Uh, the ones that she likes to eat. Okay, there's my chicken tenders. I was just doing an end card on one of these uh, videos that we. we that we saw in the I card and N cards. So I'm just doing uh, that real quick and uh, boom. Uh, basically, that's, that's what I'm doing right now. All right, uh, we'll see you in a little bit when Angie gets home. Ah, uh, change into something more comfortable oh, right hello, now. Oh, hello, YouTube. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, I've been busy. Well, I think we've all been busy today. Uh, yeah, I kind of changed into something more comfortable. That so, uh, not much happening. We dodged some rain uh, today. We got more coming. Got more coming tonight. At, tonight. So we're going to have to wrap up this vlog here a little bit. Uh, not much of a vlog, isn't it? Uh, basically, you know, every time we vlog a baseball game, and usually it's uh, 
couple of games later, wish we would have vlogged, uh, yeah, vlogged that one instead. I wish we would have did today's game. We missed a grand slam. You guys, yes, Evan, Evan, R, that's yep. what the Lumber Kings hit a grand slam into the Lumber Lodge. Yep. And they were honoring uh, our good friend, Kevin, Kevin. Chaney, uh, who passed away earlier this year. Yes. And that, so... Uh, All of his family and friends was in the Lumber Lounge. And today. that's why we missed out on it, because yeah. we were busy off-camera doing other stuff, uh, basically off-camera stuff. Because sometimes you got to balance YouTube and real life. It's really hard to do at times. But you got to do what you got to do, uh, basically. But we didn't go down to the Lumber King game today, so we didn't know... I was going to, but I... You would have been a few innings late if you would have got down there, basically. Yeah, because it was the eighth inning you hit the grand slam. Yeah, so, uh, yep. But you never know, because one time we vlogged a baseball game, and we uh, a couple of nights later, we... Actually, it was the very next night, it was a no-hitter uh, pitched by the Lumber Kings. Uh, it was a couple of years ago. Yep. And I remember one year, uh, we were going to vlog a double-header. But the first game went to 18 innings. It was an 18 inning marathon. It took almost five and a half hours to play. 18 innings, that's two nine inning games. Um, and that, so. We did do that game. Yeah, I know we did that game. We vlogged that game. Yes. We were going to do the double header. Remember? I said we were going to do the double header, because but we had to only do the one game. That's instead. when we had neighbors across the hall. Oh, that's when we had the ball players across the hall? We had ball players living up here. And then someone was right across the hall from us. Yeah. Oh. They got home late. <laughs> yeah, I would say very late because they didn't get the second game going until what? Almost what? Nine o'clock at night. Yep. And it was a and it was what a day game. Mm-hmm. It started as a day game. So it was supposed to be a day twilight. Uh, you guys, that one I have a father and son on the baseball. Oh, cool. That's Charlie. Oh, all right. Hey, uh, special update. Since we got, we're going to be very busy tomorrow off camera. We probably won't have time to pick up the camera anyway. So tomorrow, we'll be filming the final installment of Planet Coaster. Even we're filming this late in August. This is going to be up on uh, Labor Day. Time you're watching tomorrow night's uh, yeah, happy, video. Happy belated Labor Day. Well, basically, it's not belated. It's, it's, it's for us, it's early Labor Day, they're watching this video on Labor Day weekend. So when Which we do Planet busy. Coaster, when we do Planet Coaster, that'll be on Labor Day. That'll be the September installment and final installment of Planet Coaster till April 2020. Uh, because we're waiting for new updates. And while I was watching on other YouTube channels, it seems like they're fizzling down on their Planet Coaster series. So I think the game had... Uh, basically drawn out to its conclusion, so I'm hoping there's a couple more installments that they're planning to do. I want, I want at least three more coaster builds. I want at least ten more flat rides, with five of them being kid, kitty rides, uh, basically kitty slash family rides. Uh, plus, I'd like to see some game stalls where random people can go up, play the game, and walk around with stuffed animals like you do at the regular amusement park. So, um, you can set the size prize, uh, you can, what, what, you can set whatever prizes, uh, you can play, I think, you can play, get five different games, uh, of skill. Uh, maybe six different games of skill. You put them as a shop. Uh, basically, so let random like claw games that they got in the game right now, where you can set a winning percentage of that game, and it will go. Uh, basically, uh, random people will win prizes. Some will go home with nothing. Basically, so uh, I'd like to see that installed in the game somehow. I'd like to see uh, at least five more flat rides with some with maybe three classics and two something up. And five kitty rides. Maybe 15 flat rides Jeez. in total. That's a lot of wishing. I know, but I want some hot cocoa shortly, too. Oh, yeah, you want hot cocoa shortly. Let's get down to 56 degrees tonight. Ooh, a little taste of fall temperatures. Here's a taste of the end of this video right now, right? Yeah. All right, let's end it. Oh, please, like, share, subscribe. Do not forget to hit that subscribe button. And